Are we okay there? Check, 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 check. Yeah, uh, yeah, they're they're a tough team to play against. They put everything at the net, so uh, it really keeps you honest, and you have to you can't be cheating or, or not ready. So uh, sometimes it's great as a goalie to have everything put on net, and it, it really gets you in the game. So uh, you know, I think the shots were a little uh, misleading in terms of the game, but um, you know, I was able to see a lot of a lot of them, and uh, they didn't give up a whole lot of second chances for me. Talk about the role you're on, Corey. How you're feeling? I feel great. Yeah, you know, I just I'm enjoying uh, just playing and not thinking too much about it, and um, getting the net. It, it, it's a good feeling, but. Uh, you know, I'm just happy the team's winning. I think we're playing great as a group, and we're getting good scoring, and we're, we're protecting leads, and, uh, you know, I think it's, it's a good group effort. When do you have to, or when was your last role like this? Are you back in the AHL? Or what yeah, I'm sure, back in the American League. Um, haven't played this many games, obviously, at the NHL level. So, yeah, it's been a little while, but, uh, you know, you, once you get in that rhythm, it's kind of something you don't really forget. People just see 48 shots and think that your Canucks were overwhelmed, but you, you don't feel that that was the case? Or? Uh, you know, we got up early, and sometimes your tendency is to sit back a little bit. And uh, you know, we, we I think we we just kind of been but don't break defense there. So um, yeah, I think we'd like to clean up some of the turnovers and, and some of the chances. But like I said, uh, you know, I was able to see the puck most of the night. And uh, you know, when you're seeing the puck, you don't give up a whole lot of rebounds. up from your own end, ran it up, shot, circled around, and then got the goal. Yeah, I was just putting it on net, and um, Hamus made a good play by putting it back on net, and uh, when the pucks are laying there, you just got to try to get it on net, and I think it snuck through. Do you feel you've turned the corner? A lot of pressure on you to perform, of course, but do you feel you've turned the corner with tonight's game? Well, I just think, you know, I'm just trying to get better every day, you know, working on my game every time I come to the rink and, you know, working on my skills and, uh, you know, just trying to get better. So I think that's, um, you know, starting to feel a little bit more comfortable. Feel better in the flow of the Canucks? Yeah, I mean, they play a fast-paced game, you know, and it's uh, it's a fun fun team to play on, so I'm starting to enjoy it. Why does it seem you're... David, what you thought about Corey and what he's been up to lately? Yeah, he's been he's been outstanding. Uh, you know, he's been giving us the confidence to go and play the game we need to play up front, and he's making huge saves for us and really uh, really keeping us in every game. So, um, you know, we uh, we owe a lot to Corey right now. I think we're just going to keep keep uh, try to keep winning. How did it feel to go to notch that one? How did it feel? Yeah. Uh, it didn't feel bad. It felt good. <laughs> Bit of a relief or just a regular goal? Uh, no, I, you know, just just a regular goal. Yes, how does it feel right now where you're finally getting rewarded for your efforts? It seemed that uh, those chances just weren't going in a couple yeah, of weeks. Yeah, it's, it's nice. Obviously. Uh, you know, I'm a firm believer in, in, you know, sticking with the game plan and, and uh, you know, really just just uh, doing what I do night after night, and that's work hard and, and get on a forecheck and, and, you know, try to use my speed. Better scoring some points tonight as a line, or is it playing against the Nash line and sort of, you know, shutting them down? <laughs> uh, you know, for me, it's, it's uh, for, for our line, we... We obviously had that assignment tonight, and we uh, there are three really good players. Um, you know, it was tough. They're, they got a lot of speed, but uh, I thought we uh, we threw a blanket over them tonight. You talk about Corey.
Rogers post game exclusive with Max Lapierre. Uh, a lot of shots against tonight, but uh, that was a night where your goaltender was worth uh, his weight the way he's been playing lately. Yeah, it wasn't real again tonight, and uh, uh, I think we, we had a good start, but we could play better in the second and third. But uh, a win is a win, and we'll take it. Happy though with the fact that you gave up that many shots against. Uh, I know you win, and maybe the scoreline doesn't reflect, but they seem to just throw the puck on net as often as possible. Yeah, obviously, we're not happy with that. Uh, like I said, we're happy that we got the two points, but uh, uh, we know we can play uh, better defensively and uh, we'll, we'll fix it. Well, it was a night uh, where all four lines were able to get into the game early and often. I know from your perspective, that's a, a real bonus, no matter what the score line. Yeah, absolutely. That's key. Um, you know, anytime we can get our, our four lines rolling, we all changed them tonight, I thought, early. And you could tell their top guys got a little worn down by the end. They're playing a lot of minutes. And, and if we can roll our fourth line as much as we did, I mean, we're going to have success. You uh, gave up a ton of shots against. And I know Corey was there equal to the task, but is that something that the team uh, might not be too happy with, even though you win by the, the spread you had? Yeah, obviously we're not happy with uh, giving up that many shots. That's just not acceptable. I think uh, in the second period we were outchanced 11 to 4, 12 to 4, something that's not acceptable. Um, that's not the way we play, but at the end of the day, um, it's another win, and, and good teams find ways to win when they're not playing well, and, and I mean, hats off to Corey. I mean, he's the best player on the ice tonight, and he made some huge saves. He, he made some ones he should, and he made the ones he should, and I mean, hats off to him. He, 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 it was all him. No, I think I just uh, gave it to Kess, and uh, he's got a great shot, and um, I knew he was going to just uh, shoot as, as hard as he could, and um, it was a big goal for us. It was a big goal because they got the shorty to get back in it, and they're hanging around and just kind of lurking there, and you guys were able to extend the lead again. Yeah, right away. Uh, I think one minute later to get that goal, uh, Gave us another two goal cushion, and um, uh, you could feel it that uh, from then uh, we had it, I think. And um, even though they still had plenty of shots and uh, they made it tough, they battled hard. And I thought Corey was very good again tonight for us. It's kind of a quirky thing, but were you aware that those are your first home ice points of the season? Yeah, thanks for reminding me. <laughs> but uh, no, it's just a matter of bounces, I think, or. I don't know why or that is, but uh, as long as I keep working hard, uh, I think uh, they're going to even out uh, sooner than later. All right, five wins in. Is it official? Or are you guys on a hot streak? Well, we uh, certainly winning some games right now, so. Uh, you know, we wanted to uh, to win tonight, and uh, we got a great performance from our, our goaltender, <clears throat> and we were able to win the game. What about the team game overall? Are you at all concerned giving up 40 in back-to-back -back games? Well, they say never critique a win. Um, that being said, obviously giving up 22 shots in the third period was not exactly part of the overall plan. Um, you know, for whatever reason, our execution tonight, and I think it was pretty easy to see it in the neutral zone, we weren't very good with the puck. When you don't make the right plays, the other team comes at you, and that's what happened tonight. They came at us, but Corey uh, stood his ground and was, uh, again, the uh, best player on the ice tonight. Nice to see that duo of Kessler and Booth finally get rewarded over these past few games. Yeah, they've been, they've been coming along. I think, uh, you know, Ryan, as we move forward here, is... Uh, Finding his uh, flow to his game, uh, he's in a, you know making much better decisions. In David's case, he's uh, obviously going to the tougher areas. That's where he's scoring his goals, and uh, he's making room for himself. And uh, he's making making strides every game, and that's what we need. He kicked the puck in the second period there, and tweaked his groin a little bit. So I haven't gone in. I, that's what I know from. Schneider again on Thursday. Nice <laughs> you guys, well, don't ask me that right now. We're going to practice tomorrow, and I'll tell the goaltender who's playing tomorrow, and then I'll tell you guys. When you 
you guys were in that rut, let's call it a rut, for a little while, what, what do you think caused the sudden turnaround when you guys are back? Well, obviously, I think right now, uh, you know, we're getting great goaltending. And in a very competitive league, uh, goaltending on a lot of nights makes the difference and uh, covers up for a lot of mistakes. And uh, right now, our, obviously, our goaltenders, uh, Corey is probably one of the better players in, in the league at this time. He's really on top of his game, and uh, obviously, that's making a big difference. And then the longer you win here, and you seem like you're reluctant to make lineup changes, you, does, yeah. does, does the idea of a conditioning stint down in Chicago for Mason come No, in? I think uh, we'll make some decisions here in the next couple of days here. But uh, <clears throat> obviously, uh, I think uh, prior to tonight, uh, the team had played uh, you know, fairly well, well enough that uh, nobody deserved to uh, come out of the lineup. Uh, tonight, uh, I don't think we played as well as we have uh, the last couple of games, but we got a great performance from our goaltender. What can we expect in December? In the what? In December. What can we expect? Well, we're not uh, thinking about December right now. We're thinking about uh, Thursday against Nashville. Thanks. Take care, guys.